Pete Davidson reveals who he cried to after his broken engagement, and this might be the last time you hear Ariana Grande talk about her love life. Thank you. So it seems Ariana Grande is not interested in having a next boyfriend anytime soon. We don't blame you, girl. On New Year's Day, Ari responded to a fan speculating about her love life, writing, spoiler, for the rest of this year, probably my life, it's no one. Please refer back to this tweet for future questions. But shortly after her tweet, Ariana was spotted out on New Year's Day with her ex Ricky Alvarez after swearing off dating in 2019. I don't see Ari staying single forever she's just been through a lot and it's time for her to enjoy some self-love we all need it she's really got her shit together you know like she's really on it like she's got it all and um i do but i as far as like my personal life goes i really have no idea what the f i'm doing Someone who isn't quite done discussing his past, Ari's ex, Pete Davidson. The comedian got candid in a New Year's Eve show in Boston about how he cried in front of his mom after calling it quits with Ariana in October. Pete also poked fun about how most pop stars don't name their exes in songs. I mean, I can name a few, Robin Thicke, Andre 3000, I mean, the list goes on. But for 2018, Thank You Next is definitely a bop. So during the show, he reportedly joked, not this wonderful lady, this diabolical genius named all of us. Even almost got married, and for Pete I'm so thankful, wish I could say thank you to Malcolm, cause he was an angel. Like I said, Ariana is a musical genius, writing a love note to her past romances, but the singer has been really open with her fans as she mourns the loss of her ex, Mac Miller. Of course, we know they were together for two years and he had a sad, fatal overdose. Ariana shared a tribute of his hands playing on a keyboard, but quickly deleted it without an explanation. I think after Ariana's whirlwind 2018, she doesn't need to explain herself anymore in 2019. Really happy to hear Pete is in a better mental state I mean, here's to hoping comedy is his cure. And for all the latest in pop culture, be sure to subscribe to ET. Until next time, I'm at Courtney underscore Tezano. Bye for now.